God forbid, right, and Celtic fans won't like me for saying this, but God forbid Ange Postacoglu resigns tomorrow mm. or he goes somewhere. Peter Lobo phones you and says, look, Martin, end of the season, take the reins, caretaker manager, could you be tempted? Uh, for for two games, Daniel, yeah, yeah. That, oh, that's always a temptation for two games, you know, particularly if they're both at Celtic Park and against teams in trouble all right okay <laughs> then i'll then then i'll take it w one then yeah th thanks for asking one it's not going to happen uh and um, postal is going to stay around for some time uh and uh, he's going to be caged in there as well too so we're going to keep him uh, and that's that's very very important to do so and secondly i had a fantastic time really fantastic time i really had of course You'd love to change some things. You'd love to change the uh, the uh, UEFA Cup final result. You'd love to change the Motherwell result, those two in particular. But overall, honestly, I had the time of my life there. And um, and the torches passed to other other people. And uh, I would, uh, one, it won't, it won't happen. Dermot Desmond would not ask me back again for even for those two games that I'm asking him for. <laughs> and... Uh, so it's not going to happen, Daniel. Honestly, and in, in all honesty, I, I I don't think it would be. I don't I, coming back. I've been back a couple of times, and uh, it's great to see the atmosphere still there, which will always be there. You listen, even when we all pass pass this uh, uh, this time on earth as well too. So uh, I no, it's I had a fantastic time, and uh, but it's part of the side now. Torch has passed, and it's been carried on delightfully, brilliantly by the, the man in charge now.